This is a quick video showing you this foldable learning tool to organize direct object pronouns, possessive adjectives, and articles all in one sheet. And the idea of this is that students will be able to organize in their brains the difference between these four things because they can be easily confused with one another, you know, L with an accent, and then over here we've got L without an accent, and then LA, and then direct object pronoun LA, and just being able to organize kind of in their brains and on paper the difference between them. And I find it very useful when um, students are getting confused and you're seeing them write things like, you know, yo, tu entiendo for I understand you. You can show them no too, that's the subject pronoun, you need to use a direct object pronoun, so let's just, you know, blank these out and look at just the direct object pronouns. Now what is um, you as a direct object pronoun, and then they can see that it's te. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to fold this in half, you're going to open it back up, and you're going to fold it in half on this side, and make sure you crease that really good, and you're going to fold it in half on this side and now you can see that we almost have our four flaps we just have two flaps and so you're going to open it back up and you're going to take a scissors and you're going to cut right on this black line to the crease and you are going to cut on this black line on the other side to the crease and you can see that now we have our four flaps. And so usually I would have students fill this out ahead of time. And then we've got our four flaps here, which you would then write your titles on. And that's it. Yeah. Going on race, Senator Ashby. Yeah. Here we go. Los pronoun race. Los pronoun race. Los pronoun race. Los pronoun race. Yo is I. I is yo. Learn in the pronouns as we flow. Two is you. The informal way. It's how you greet your friends each and every day. L is he. A is she. Rapping subject pronouns. So sing your ash be the formal you. Yeah, that's who's dead. Use it with the elderly. Get it in your head. No so tros. Is how you say we. No so trust. If it's only ladies, vote so tros. Y'all in Spain, ustedes in Mexico means the same. Ayos, yeah, that means they. Ayos for the ladies. Los pronoun race. Los pronoun race. Yo, we want, I mean, want yo. We are gonna play out in the snow. No so tros, it's easy to see. Instead of want yo, you can just say we. Los chicos, los chicos y too. I'm talking to a group and I'm including you. I'd say los otros, it's y'all in Spain. Or just say ustedes, it means the same. L-E-A-Y-A, he and she. They are going to 